Hey, I'm back. Back to the ha ha. I'm not apologizing. She's turned back. What the heck happened to you? She's an angel living inside me. I hate her. That's mean. Hate's a strong word. An angel? I got mixed up with her somehow. She screwed up my life ever since. You got mixed up with her? What do you mean? I'm tired and she managed to take over my body and apologize to you. I certainly wouldn't have done it. Look, I'll have no problem getting out of here, but will you at least give me a chance to rest? I think she's being honest this time. She does look really tired. Yeah, you can get some rest at my place. We can get freaky. Oh, yes, we can get freaky. Okay, I accept, so we can get freaky. I'll take a break at your house and get freaky with you. Alright, let's go get freaky. I don't know what you're thinking, which is getting th freaky. Well, I'll go tell the chief about the fallen stones and the fact that I'm a female. Thanks, Ryoga. Hey, wait up. What now? We haven't been introduced yet. I'm Spanky. That guy's Ryoga. Don't call me that guy. I'm a girl. Oh, sorry. And what's your name? Oh, Dinah. <laughs> oh, wait, the chick? The chick lady? Oh, that's a stupid name. How about... Sorry. Yes. Right on the hit. Nice meeting you, Osafili. Hmm. I guess it doesn't hurt to know your name. Well then, let's go back to my place. Hmm. Nice place. Whoa. Well, how's it going, Osafili? Are you feeling better? Hmm. I could rest for a while longer. Oh, Tatiana, did you get me something with lots of panel like I asked? Hey, I don't like your attitude. And what's mana anyway? What? You don't know what mana is? Orin, you've heard of it, haven't you? Of course. Mana is... Chisms. You don't need to lecture me now. Orin, you're treating her far too nicely, isn't it? It's just because she's a girl, isn't it? Duh. Why are you getting angry at me? I didn't do anything. Let her be a little spoiled. Osafili's sick, you know. Oh, thank you, Oren. Don't shout, Tatiana. It's embarrassing me. What a bitch. Don't talk to her like that, bitch. I guess you were being a little loud in front of our guest, Tatiana. What? Why me? You're yelling. See, you're shouting again. See, Orin knows. Hey, hey, calm down, you two. Dot, dot, dot. I can see you have lots of problems here, huh? Why doesn't it show the freaking names for these two characters? Just because I named them doesn't mean I always know it at all times. I can easily forget. I didn't expect to get sympathy from you. Oh, do we have a guest? Oh, Master. He kind of looks like Gara. Welcome to Craft Knight Blair's place. Hey, a summon creature. We don't get too many of them around here. Who's her master? Um, heroin. I don't have a master right now. That means you must be eradicated. You're a stray de summon. Is that right? Yes. Hmm. What are we going to do now? Yeah, stray summons aren't allowed inside the village. Let's kill the fuck out of her. What are you saying? I'm only here because Spanky invited me. Bitch, please. Is that right, Spanky? No. Well, no. If you insist on expelling me from the village, then you'll have to guide me to a safe place filled with mana. Like you promised, remember? I have never said the word promised ever in my life. 
I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, Mitch. Wait a second. I never promised you that. Great, now I said it. The cat's out of the bag. Now you deny it. Tisk, tisk. If you want to help me, you have to see it through to the end. That's how it goes. Start packing. There's no mana around here, so it'll be a long trip. Bring lots of food. Son of a bitch. Fuck this chick. Fuck this chick to hell and back. Not even back, just to hell. Keep her there. Let her get freaking all kinds of shit of punishment from Satan. And then just leave and then lock hell up so that no one else can go back. Fuck that bitch. But I don't know of anywhere like that. Then go find it. Oh my god. Don't try to drag me along until you know where you're going. Well, I'll never know where I'm going, so I guess we're not going. Why, you mean-spirited little psycho. Well, there you go. That's nice. Okay, I'm over it. There's nothing wrong with me. You should be glad to have the opportunity to help me like this. I. And she's gonna be an angel again. Is she going to flip out again? I. Am. Sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, she's... This is one bipolar bitch. Whoa, she transformed. Oh no, I'm very sorry. Hey Spanky, what's going on? Don't worry, she's gonna change right back. Yeah, old Philly said that there is an angel inside her. I guess it comes out whenever she gets too nasty. That's a rare summon creature. I'm very sorry that we said such terrible things to you. After you let us into your home. Oh dear. I don't think it's your fault. Yes, it is. I can't control her emotions, and she says such horrible things. Please excuse us. We'll be out of here right away. Oh, hey, look. Don't worry. You don't have to run away like this. Son of a bitch, Tatiana, shut your fat mouth. Oh, no. I can't intrude any further. Please, just let us leave you alone and not bother you anymore. Yes. What now? I'm sorry. Nig. Ah. Uh, Son of a bitch, she lasts for like 10 seconds and then she's gone. God. Hey, are you alright? Ha, uh, ha. Uh. She made me apologize again. Twice in one day. I can't believe it. Is it that hard for you to apologize? Ha, 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 ha. It looks like you two are having fun together. Shut up, Gara. What? Are you paying attention? What? I was having fun just watching them argue. Shut up, Tatiana. Duh, duh, duh. Listen, Osafili. We're a Craft Knight family. We fuck deer. Craft Knights? You mean those who melt metal and then hammer that to make things, right? A Craft Knight basically makes weapons. We have a workshop in the basement. Would you like to check it out? Uh, hey. What? Why the fuck? What the fuck? She's not even holy shit. Come with us, Spanky. Oh, uh, wait. That's some weird shit. Alright. Let's get a move on. Yeah, you can run doors. What the fuck's going on? This is our workshop. We make our weapons here. The unique thing about Craft Knights is that we can borrow the power of Guardian Beasts to help us. With their assistance, we can make some special weapons that can't be made with fire and steel alone. We must also train ourselves to be effective fighters with our weapons. Those who know how to use weapons are better at understanding how to make them, you see. Shut up. It's pretty hot down here. And now it's a Philly. How would you like to be a guardian beast for Spanky? A guardian beast? This is pretty sudden. I've never had a girlfriend before. A guardian beast? Hey, are you telling me to protect this person? The role of a guardian beast is to have sex with their master and ensure the safety of the group. There are many dangers involved in collecting materials, but there's more to it than just that. What I mean is, it must become a partner to its master in order to make superior weaponry. A partner to make weapons? How is it usually how it usually works is that guardian beasts are called by a summon talisman only when forging a weapon, like I do. But that's not going to work in your case, Osophili. 
And just why should I agree to this proposal? Let me be blunt. We can't allow stray summons in this village. Even if we were to kick you out, Spanky might be punished just for bringing you here. We're really... Oh, what did I get myself into? Women are nothing but trouble. If you become Spanky's guardian beast, you won't be a stray summon anymore, and you can stay. Not only that, but you'll have a new partner. Everyone comes out ahead, except me, who has to drag this annoying bitch along wherever he goes. Yes, indeed. Spanky, you're so lucky. Oh yes, I feel it. Fucking touch I'm gonna slap your bitch ass. Hey, please wait a second. Master, what's wrong? I know Orin has a summon talisman to summon his guardian beast, but that shouldn't be necessary with mine. Dot dot dot. Hey, you can't just treat me as an object to be passed around. Yes I can, bitch. Shut your mouth. Uh, I didn't mean it like that. Actually, I did. I'm just being polite with my verbal will. Uh, keep clicking with my stupid mouth. Uh, stupid mouth. I see how it is, bitch. All humans are like this. I'm done with them. Get out of my way. Oh, Zephili, I don't know your story, and you may have suffered at the hands of humans. You were summoned to this world and live as a stray summon, but can't you trust a human and Spanky one more time? Why does he just make this? Trust Spanky, huh? Dot dot dot. What am I supposed to do? Believe. It wasn't just a coincidence that Spanky brought you here, O Philly. Spanky rescued you and brought you here out of pure goodwill. You could say that, I guess. It makes sense to me that you two ought to make a pledge to be partners. Spanky already has a duty to protect me. Not really. That doesn't automatically make you my guardian beast, you know. Ha, uh, are you saying that you can't do anything unless a little girl like me has to watch your back? What? I said no such thing. It doesn't matter. I won't help a human unless they swear to protect me as well. You can't be my master until you swear the same kind of oath you're asking me to make. Dot dot dot. Fine, I swear that I'll do my best to protect you. What? Unbelievable. You just told me. Oh god. Thank you very much. I wasn't expecting that, and I won't expect it anymore. Stop it's annoying. Even though I said such terrible things before, you said those sweet words now. Thank you. You're really, uh, handsome. Uh, wait a second. And, wow. Gra, thanking a human. My mouth tastes like a licked slug. Like I licked a slug. Look, if you get involved in this, it'll just screw me up even more than I am now. Matt, <laughs> whack up. I'm starting to get the same idea. Ha ha ha, I think you'll be a good team. Shut up, Horn. No way. Uh, I agree. You don't have a problem communicating with each other. Dot dot dot. It's a deal. What? All right. It's not official until the bonding pledge is publicly signed. So I'll go gather everyone to the monument square. Come with me, Osophili. Uh, hey, wait. Catch up with me later. Later, bitch. There goes Orin. Spanky. Yes, master. You're a good kid. Thank you. Where did that come from all of a sudden? What are you plotting? Heh heh heh. Nothing harmful, I promise you. Well, we'll find out next time then, won't we? Later.